Alaska will be out for seven days. So uh, just an FYI on uh, on that. We'll have Coach in here shortly. Everybody got the update? Just a tailbone contusion on uh, for Curry. Will James, Eric, and everyone in uh, the protocols just stay in Houston for the next week? Um, I'm not exactly sure, um, Anthony. Um, you know, there, there's uh, there's been some talk that we may be able to get people home to the bay. Um, not everybody, but um, you know the the players and the and the other people who are. Uh, did not test positive, but are in, in contact tracing. So um, that's the hope that uh, we'll be able to get get some people home. But uh, I don't know for sure yet. Steve, is there any frustration level of, of how this situation with, with James, Eric, and happened? Or is I'm sorry, Anthony, I, I lost you there. Frustration level with what? How this situation with James, Eric, and every you know whatever happened is their frustration with what happened. Uh, of course, there's uh, frustration, but it, there, there's nobody to blame. You know, nobody is at fault here. Uh, th these are the circumstances. This is the life we're living right now. Uh, the league has to be overly cautious uh, in order to uh, make sure everybody. Uh, is able to stay healthy and and the league is able to function. And so we fully uh, respect the league's decision. Uh, at the same time, we're, we're uh, frustrated uh, for for Eric and James. But uh, as I told you guys before the game, it's uh, we have to take the, the long view here. Both both Eric and James have, have long, great careers ahead of them. And uh, yeah, this is going to be a short window of time and uh, it won't affect them. You know, they're healthy, they're doing fine. So uh, got to look at the bright side. Right. All right. Thanks, everybody. Have a good night. Thank all right, we'll have a few players in here. So sure. obviously stay in contact. You know, you're talking about, you know, Texan G League coaches and stuff like that. Do you need to stay in contact over the next seven days with James, with Eric, as they're basically detached from the team? Um, uh, for sure. Um, you know, especially being stuck in the house. No one wants to be stuck in the house. That kind of sucks. But, um, you know, just really making sure those guys stay a part of things. Uh, you know, it's – Obviously, sucks that they got to be away for however many days they will be. But you know, it's important that you know everybody's reaching out and keeping their spirits up and keeping them engaged. Draymond, obviously, a lot of things change when you're missing two of your big men like that for a week. What do you think changes the most without James and Eric? Uh, what changes the most? Um, well, those are two of our better scorers. You know, uh, those are two guys that put a lot of pressure on the rim. You know, and so you take that out the lineup, you miss it. Uh, you know, and then also just continuing to get those guys experience. You know, I, I know it It seems like the people that Eric's been around quite a while because he played so much last year, but he's still a second-year player. You know, James a first-year player. So, uh, that, you know, that's important experience that they're missing the opportunity on as well. So... Uh, you know, and I think Eric, uh, with his versatility, kind of allows us to go different lineups, and, and, and he's a matchup problem, so we'll miss that as well. How does this team, how is this team different when you don't have James and, and, and Eric out there? Uh, you know, they bring a lot of uh, anchoring on the defensive end, um, a lot of strength and a lot of size. Um, you know, it's unfortunate what happened, but at the end of the day, that's the, you know, the new world we live in. So we got to kind of handle that as it comes and get through it. Obviously, uh, Kelly, that stuff that's out of your guys' control and it's kind of the new normal, which is unfortunate. But is it important to kind of keep them in the loop and be in contact with them over the next seven days since they'll essentially be away from the team in the protocol? 
Yeah, of course. Um, you know, we, as brothers, you know, we all have to make sure that, you know, they're in high spirits and they keep their head up to this tough time. But it's really above all of us, so we can only control what we can control.